Here we are from TimCast.com. Elon Musk successfully buys Twitter. Twitter's board reached a deal in the billion dollar bid to sell Tesla CEOs, uh, Tesla to, to sell to Tesla's CEO and take the company private. Do you know what happens on Thursday, guys? You no. tell me. Freedom Tunes uploads a new cartoon. Twitter's earnings report. Oh, well, and, that too. And what do you think that earnings report would show? Something good or something bad? Bad. Something bad. Mm. Because Twitter's been struggling for some time. You look at any news story over the past several months, and they say Twitter is lagging, not reaching its goals. Which means, I'm willing to bet Elon Musk played some 4D chess. He knew the earnings report was coming up, and he knew he had to act now. He offered $54.20 per share. If on Thursday news comes out that the earnings were not good, the stock would likely fall. The board knows this. They know what their earnings are. If they rejected a $54.20 offer, knowing no. that their stock would be worth half that by Thursday, they would be liable for damages for not adhering to their fiduciary duty to the shareholders. And that could be, what, $20 billion? If the earnings report came out and the stock dropped to 40 or 30 bucks, the board's like, nah, I don't want to be responsible for that money. I don't want to be sued for that. Just give them the deal. Done. Mm -hmm. We'll see what the investors say. We'll see what this means, but I think Elon Elon Musk he, he cornered them masterfully. Their uh, their main source of their earnings, as far as I can tell, is ad revenue. Uh, it's a very risky proposition for a company to roll that die because if the advertisers get disenfranchised or disgruntled, they'll pull their their money, which means that Twitter's basically an advertising firm. No, I call shenanigans. Point. Shenanigans. Twitter banned ads that deny their their opinions on climate change. So hmm. if Twitter is holding up their duty to their shareholders, they wouldn't they wouldn't say no to advertisements on political grounds. Twitter outright said, we don't want your money if you if you disagree on climate science. Interesting. Do you well, think they would try to make the argument that, uh, you know, taking money from those groups would limit their ability to make a profit in the future because they could damage their reputation? I don't think that's going to work in court. I don't think it's just that. I think that they killed virality they made the site boring because the board of directors represents other companies which feels like twitter is worth more to them dead than alive hmm. and so what you've got is a twitter that's dead under their reign elon's like this company is worth a lot to me alive it's worth a lot to me if i can bring back the excitement of viral content that comes from twitter when it was a free marketplace of ideas and my only regret about all of this is that I don't get to take that ride with Elon Musk anymore because shareholders were all going to get bought out and he's taking it private. Yes, full disclosure, I have 22 shares oh my. Uh, uh, through my brokerage app. When Elon Musk announced he bought it, I was like, all right, I opened up my account. I had a thousand bucks and I clicked buy. And I think I'll end up making like a hundred bucks. Oh, not bad. Yeah, not bad. Thanks, Elon. I will, I will buy a delicious umami burger. So what you're saying your is that this show is funded by Elon Musk. This is propaganda. Completely. You've just acknowledged it. We've lost it, all it, credibility. It, it costs $100 <laughs> per 10 years, per decade, to run this. That's all it is. And you know that $100 funds everything. 